But I need to tell you something. Like you cut G. I'm new here, so what can I expect? From the top, make it drop, that's some wet, that's some wet. Now get a bucket and a mop, that's some wet. That's well, <sighs> why have I done this to myself? What? They bugging, bro. Why, bro? Bro, bro. She made fucking beans. What the? F you ever been to the beach and wondered where the hell is the sea? <laughs> I will do what I must. It's over, Anakin! I have the high ground! You underestimate my power! Don't try it! Hello, people of TikTok. News update one of my TikToks got removed for harassment and bullying. I've re uploaded it because I don't care. I don't care. Uh, a, I knew there was a reason I hated this platform. Uh, so if you want to see it again, it's just called It Happened Again brackets re upload. You can also watch it on the JDT Clips channel. I've got three reasons why it might have been removed. It might have been removed because A, the person who I tagged a, a, a account got removed for some reason. So I've not tagged them this time. Uh, maybe because of the comments that somebody made. Uh, I am not Ted Bundy. So, yeah, stop commenting that. And uh, the other option is getting slapped around the head. And if that's the case, then TikTok grow up. The only reason I'm doing this is because I'm friends with Summit. I know I'm gonna get a lot of hate for this, but to that I say, I don't care about 12 year olds situation about a spud apparently. One of Summit's friends, screenshot was sent in a Discord and she read it out and she accidentally said the no word. The problem is this spud man, he wouldn't have cared if it wasn't for the dad jokes that were made. I know that Big Spud didn't say it himself, but he laughed at joke saying it's, it's Axis. Dad uh, did bad thing uh, R4PE and he laughed at a joke about that. Being R4PE'd by your dad, uh, that thing you do not have Spud, is not epic. In the N-word, even if accident or not, I know it's a bad thing. I personally believe she should be forgiven. Daddy Spud apparently, he doesn't even have one. Gamers, come out to play, yay! It's the lawnmower, back at it again. Responding to Spud, Spud Potato Man comments. I'm not gonna read the full written report he sent me, but I'm gonna point out three parts. He doesn't know who Summit is. How do you not know who Summit is? He is a very famous man. He is uh, almost as famous as Dwayne The Rock Johnson. Apparently, It's Axis says the naughty new word three times. Well, Mr. Spud isn't gonna like me and Visual Depression streams from 2019. We were very horrible people back then. He said I sound like I am a starting lawnmower when I uh, mouth words. I don't know what you are talking about. Bruv, what is this? Cuned? I'm 15. Oh yes, saying your age makes your point valid. Are you recording this under the water? You got me. How are you? I am under the water. Please help me.
I don't know where to go! I don't know where to go! And I don't know what to do! Shut the door! <laughs> Subscribe to my YouTube channel, please. Uh, I do gaming, commentary, uh, pretty much everything. Uh, my goal is 1.5k. The link will be in the description of this video that you're watching. And it is in my TikTok uh, thing where you can click the channel. So, yeah. So, please subscribe or else. These are three things that I hate. Part one. Motorcycles. They would be okay if every single time I try to record something, they just don't go <laughs> Shut up, no one cares. And when they rev down the street, that goes for any car. When they rev down the street, who thinks you're cool? No one. Another thing that I really, really, really hate is none other than first comments. This coming from YouTube, uh, First comment, who cares if you're first? Nobody cares if you're first. Like two years ago I made a video saying that my cat had just died. R.I.P. Ray Ray. And I got a first comment. I don't care that you're first, my cat's just died. The, the final thing is paper straws. I get that they're trying to save the environment, but come on man, there's a better way than using paper straws. They don't even work. You like get three drinks out of it and they disintegrate or they bend or they rip. Those are three things that really grind my gears. Oh. Oh, run at me, run at me, go on. <laughs> so you're telling me you can get famous and make tons of money and music videos by nodding your head. Let's try that out. <laughs> Did it work though? We're going to ask some uh, uh, people about what they think about the youth. It's going to be epic, isn't it, Cameron? Yeah. Um, uh, do you want to give us some advice about the youth? Uh, get all the scrubs. Let's go. Got any advice for the youth? No. Cameron, you got any advice for the youth? Yeah, don't jump off a cliff. My advice to the youth uh, die. Look at him. What are you doing? Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. My advice to you. Again? Nothing. Oh, oh my god. Right. It's good advice, huh? Don't Thank you. Have... Cameron, can you tell us a yeah. joke, please? I've got another joke for you all. So, what's Gandhi with pink hair? Gandhi floss. Hey. Aiden, can right. you tell us a joke? I got another one. What do you call a bunch of artistic kids with guns? What? Special forces. So, Jacob, do you have a joke for us? I do, actually. <laughs> what do you call a Mexican who's lost his car? Carlos. Put a finger down challenge, except if you put any fingers down, I don't like you. Put a finger down if you would make fun of someone for being a furry. These are three things that I hate, part two. First thing, snowflakes. I hate them. Not the kind that fall from the sky. The ones that can't take a joke. Just, it's a joke, take it or leave it. If you don't like offensive humour, fine, but you don't have to go into a strop about it and like, cancel culture! Just get a grip, man. Another thing that annoys me, another thing that I hate, Bad guys in movies. Why can't they just, like, you know, function normally? Like, normally they'd win. 
If it was in an ideal world, they'd win, wouldn't they? But no, they don't win. They just get beat by the hero for making, like, one blunder. Or their plan that they've gone over several times fails to one little guy. The bad guys would win in a real-life scenario, and you cannot tell me that isn't true. And the final thing that I want to rant about today, another thing that I hate is none other than when your parents do this. I'm my mother. Jacob! What? When they don't respond, I'm shouting. Uh, like the video if you can relate to this. I, you shout so loud, somebody in China can hear you, right? But your mum or your dad cannot hear you. So they make you go and stand up and go to them. It's so annoying. What the fuck? Yeah. Okay. Sorry about that shit, but what the fuck? I've been chasing bitches in the money since the No. Stop. Stop now, please. Why do people enjoy this? If you ever wanna fall, can I be the one you call? If you wanna be a star, I can tell you what it costs. I was gonna put you on, I was gonna put you on, on. I was gonna change your life, girl, but I don't wanna break your heart. What did Addison Ray see in this guy? This man's life must be very shallow, especially after being dropped by Austin McBroom tomorrow and being dropped by Addison Ray. Our co main event, let's send it up to the ring. Here are the judges' results for this sanctioned exhibition match. Lorenzo Hunt scored the contest 49 of 46. Coach Chuck scored the contest 49 of 46. And Keon Wilson scored the contest 50 to 46. The combined scores put the bout in favor of a majority draw. What? That's a load of rubbish. How's Taylor Holder got that then? He threw like two punches. And Eason Gibb was mega in that match. And it's gone to a draw. Go subscribe to my main YouTube channel. The link is in where the YouTube link is on TikTok. I'm so close to 1.4k subscribers. So please get me there and please get me a bit closer to 1.5k because I've got something planned. Uh, yeah, please. And also, go subscribe to the JDT Clips channel. This is where I post the re-uploads of my TikToks and also some exclusives up there as well. So go check that out as well. Proper British Dishes Part 1472. Apple, bread, bread, apple put apple on bread apple sandwich this was a delicacy in world war Two when they needed nutrition and fruit at the same time this was absolute delicacy proper british dishes look at that apple sandwich beautiful proper british dishes part 1465 apple on a wrap, wrap it up, apple wrap. This was delicacy during the Vietnam War when they wanted a uh, nice wrap, but they also wanted fruit at the same time. This was absolute delicacy. Dog check. Hello, dog. Hello, doggy. <laughs> <laughs> I want to go forward in a straight line, that's my, that's my end goal. My main goal is to 
Well, you've mastered the spinning around in a circle. Oh, I get it. 16% off on that bottle. Oh, yeah? Squat down already. Go on, Jacob. <laughs> 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 Take you a bit to learn. Go! <laughs> and then once you've mastered it, it'll be fine. Go! Yes, now turn! Yay! Turn around! Ben! Ben! I'm gonna have in my face. Now go, go, go! These are three things that I hate, part three. The first thing is Love Island. We don't like Love Island. It's just like, just... Why? All it is, is people going to an island to go, Oh yeah, have sex with me. Don't clip that. Second thing. That I hate is licorice and dandelion burdock. Anything that tastes like that. <coughs> That's my reaction to it. Dreadful. Tastes like... Bad. And coming in at number three is when people think they are right when they are wrong, when you know you are right. So if you say something and they're like, No, 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 it's not, no, it's not, no, it's not. I'm right, they're wrong. They're like saying Obama died, Obama's alive, and I'm saying Obama died in 1982, 24th November. I'm right. Tommy Innit has been cancelled. Why has Tommy Innit been cancelled? Tommy Innit has been cancelled for not being fully educated about all of the... LGBTQ. He's 16! I hate Tommy in it, but I've been through the same experience. I've not been cancelled, but I've had a large group of people called Fruit Salad. I'm calling you out right now, Fruit Salad. Uh, I didn't understand all the pronoun things. I understand now, and I fully respect that. But I was confused, so I asked them... Oh, what does this mean? And they were like, YOU NEED TO KNOW! How am I supposed to know if I've not been educated?
what's the similarity between a tick and the Eiffel Tower? They're both parasites. Ah! Hey, do you want to hear a joke about construction? I'm still working on it. Ah! I'm afraid for the calendar. Its days are numbered. It's okay. These are three things that I hate, part four. Uh, the first one is being falsely accused. Everybody gets falsely accused, but it's I, I hate it so much because inside you know that you didn't do whatever they are talking about. Like, for example, haha, JDT burnt down the orphanage. Maybe I did. <laughs> I'm joking, by the way, but... I didn't do it, I didn't do it, and then nobody believes you, it's just the it's annoying. The second thing is the one, the only, when people sing the wrong words to a song. If you're gonna sing, at least know the words! I don't know why it annoys me so much. But I hate it, 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 I despise it. And the final thing, it grasses. People who are like, I'm going to tell on you. <laughs> Do it then. No one cares. Oh, ah! So annoying. Stunt grass on people, you m